Welcome to our channel, Dolph, Yuri, and my workmates. Now we're not going to work with boards or sketchboards. Let's decorate an art box from Linden. Our size is 52 centimeters of length and 26 centimeters of white. A bed box isn't extended. Our white is 2 centimeters, but will be increased to 3.5 centimeters in white, but now it is 2 centimeters in width. How should an device start? You should lay down a sharpener, dividers, a ruler, and a protrator. On your workplace, the first etap of our work is elementary marking. I recommend you to put an angle ruler. It will be easier for you to work. Let's measure an inner part. Let's leave two centimeters from our aside parts. Take two centimeters. On this drawing you can do with a ruler and to make a straight line with a ruler who is more professional at this you can do it with your hands by doing simple marks. Now we rotate And do the same action and rotate till marking all the sides from two sides. It means you mark two halves. I had line two halves. Don't forget about the first half or the second half. Side long lines are made. Now we don't touch the previous marks and continue marking our wooden surface. At first we search a center, the first mark is 50 cm. Our general length is 52 cm. And now we have to divide 52 cm in half. If you can't do it, just do it with your calculator. Mark 52 centimeters and half of 52. So it means how much? 26 centimeters. <laughs> Certainly, 26. Make a point and with our angle ruler make a line. Make a line here and make a line here. So now rotate to a slot and measure it to almost 26 centimeters. How much is the half of 26? 13. 13 is a mark. Identify white half and draw our line. So we make our line and there is a center here. With no doubt the most interesting position made is rosette. You can make it with many sides, very interesting and extraordinary. But let's make something another. So if our half in an inner part has 10 and 9 centimeters, but is almost 11 centimeters, so what can we do? Let's make a mark what is half a centimeter from edges. Let's 
So make a mark what is half of a centimeter from edges, from a side parts. The sections should be made from all the sides. Half, half. The same half we should take here. So here is five, half of a centimeter. We take a ruler. There is a difference between drawing from an inner part and from the outside. If we draw from an inner side, we'll make a lot of mistakes with calculations, and so we should draw not from the inner side. Stand a ruler and drew. And so here. So our lines can be not too straight, and that's why we have to take an eraser too. And so here, we draw the same half of a centimeter that we marked. Half of a centimeter. Let's make our cells. Let's take 5 centimeters of a working part from the second line. We have to get 5 centimeters. 5, 5, from in another side 5. And five. Five. Rotate and mark from <coughs> the edges, from the side parts, five. and mark five. Five. Mark. Five. Five. According to our five centimeters, we have to make a line. So we united our points into one line. Our points are extents of 5 centimeters. And now we have to take half of a centimeter. In an order we have to make half of a centimeter in the future. So we've broken our fields in 5 centimeters and now standard ruler and make a word work field. So we've broken our work field. Five centimeters too. So we get a work field. By our lines, what we have marked, in an order, we mark half of a centimeter, and here half of a centimeter. For not to be confused, stand it in the inner part. Don't hurry up. So 
extend a ruler and draw. As we have marked half of a centimeter, and now we mark half of a centimeter in outside part, not inner part. So we marked our half of a centimeter. At this moment you should concentrate and not to be distracted. And we make our landmark. So landmark is ready. And for yourself not to be confused on a field. And so lines wouldn't be merged. I recommend you to shade the outlines. So our lines wouldn't be merged, I recommend you to shade the outlines. As I show, and don't touch other one part. It is especially useful for novices. So now we'll shade our outlines. In this line, make the same. So we made. By this way we made a work position and now let's keep on. The full cell is 6 cm. If you count half of a centimeter of a left side and half of a centimeter of a right side. So that's how we have a general 6 cm of a full cell. So our working place inner part is 5 cm and sides are half of a centimeter and half of a centimeter. Everything is right. 5 and half. In this side, half. 5 and half. Five and a half. With no doubt, we have to do the same here. Angles aren't always straight. For accuracy, you have to double. Five and a half. I repeat, we have to double our marks for accuracy. Five and a half. So make a line. Five and a half. 
We make it with a ruler, not an angle ruler, but with a ruler. Now rotate. Five. Get further. Half. Further. Five. And half. What do we have? Make a drawing position. It is especially useful for beginners who not to be confused to use a rosette possession. We can to use a rosette position if you want so now we have our dividers and make our marks everything that is an extra place we erase now we use in another technique now we'll fulfill our cells as it is but in the central square is absent a lateral site right here our inner size is 4 and 7 approximately so here is left 4 and 7 2 almost 5 centimeters if we take half of a centimeter from here and replace it here then a cell here will be too small and here is too large so that's why we need to create an edge. So we take two and five millimeters on the central lines. Now from the outside, let's draw line is made. So now we paint over here. I see that the lines aren't straight enough, so we have to erase this part and to redo it with a ruler. So we have drawn our general line and we have working cells. So working cells are made. Now make a traditional position. So make new lines. They are really similar to diagonals of our squares.
сделан этот, кстати, коробка сделан по положению не по морилке будем работать, по работаем по положению именно оттенения. So diagonals are made. The box will be made with a shade position. Понимаете, в чем это отличается, допустим, от рельефных позиций, что такое, когда мы работаем через лекала и прочее. So, the main moment is geometrical. Что такое смещение геометрической позиции согласно там, тем или иным чертежам, что мы имеем? As you see, some of the diagonals aren't appropriate, aren't straight enough. Толстые карандаши и прочее. They have to be straight. That means that it is... Не показать это практически, а говорить на уровне слов. Very important to use a crayon of a right rigidity, a ruler, or bed calculations, a ruler with any damages. If you have seen that there is a trouble, is here, then you have to repaint it, redo it, and then erase it and redo your markings. As I know how to correct all of this, then I won't be erasing, but you have to erase it. It is really essentially. So we make the second diagonal of our square, which should be similar to Christ. Everything should be symmetrical. It should be symmetrical, it is really important. So we made our cells. Now we'll be doing some actions. It is carving from inner side. It is a technique of shading. Now the side parts we don't touch. So our review is made. The next video is carving. It will be with angles, straight positions, flags, point, half, circles, which are produced by the next video is carving with the best wishes and all of Yuryev and our workmates. Watch attentively, the further, the more interesting.